third problem construct a rhombus so we need to construct a rhombus the lengths of whose diagonals are 6 cm and 7 cm so they have given the lengths of the diagonals okay let us let us draw a rough diagram of the rhombus so rhombus will look like this and these are its diagonals so they have given the measurement of this 6 cm and 7 cm now we will start the solution so in solution we will write they have given what they have given so given that a b c d okay a b c d b a rhombus so we are going to take this a b c d a rhombus and the diagonals ac and bd so this will be our diagonals b the diagonals of the rhombus so let us take this acb ac is equals to 6 cm and bd is equals to and bd is equals to 7 cm okay next we know that the diagonals of a rhombus bisect each other at right angle so let us write that since diagonals of a rhombus bisect each other at right angles so that means they will make a 90 degrees angle when they intersect okay now let us start the start drawing okay for that we know that we are having one diagonal that is 7 centimeter so that we have taken here as bd okay so let us draw that first We will draw a 7 centimeter line, a line segment of 7 centimeter. Okay. Let this be B D. Now we will take more than half of this line segment. Okay, the radius will be more than half of the line segment from d let us draw an arc we are making a perpendicular bisector next from point b again draw an arc which cuts the previous arcs now let us join these points So if we join these points, we will get a perpendicular bisector. So let this be x and this be y. Now, with the help of protector, we know that this line segment is of 7 centimeter. Okay for 6 cm we know that 3 cm comes above this line and 3 cm comes below this line for that first we will take the radius of 3 cm so let us take the radius of 3 cm so this is the radius of 3 cm 
now from the point let this point be o from the point o draw a draw an arc which cuts the line line segment xy line xy you can say now this point is our a and this is a b c now let us join this point a d b c from c to d next from b to a hence our required quadrilateral is formed so at the end we can write down a line hence a b c d is the required rhombus